One German aluminum factory is taking drastic action to deal with the mounting gas crisis. The 200-year-old GA Roders facility is due to be temporarily shut down. The family-owned firm wants to move to three weeks of 24-hour shifts, followed by a one-week closure. Managing director Gert Roders hopes that will help him maintain output and cut the gas bill, which has doubled since last year. You have to know that starting up a foundry like this, heating up the furnace, is very energy intensive. But when it's running, we can keep energy at a good level here. Shutting it down in the evening, shutting it down overnight, and heating it up in the morning is crazily expensive. Roders believes the plan will save the cost of gas needed to fire up the ovens every morning. Though it also means paying staff more to work night shifts. Now, surviving the gas crisis, could also see buyers carry the costs. Our customers are not interested in us going bankrupt either. In this respect, we're laying out our prices to customers and telling them they have to pay more. There's no use in delivering parts, putting money on top and earning nothing. GA Roders produces more than 1,000 parts for major clients like Volkswagen and Continental. Its plans to shut down come with Germany's energy regulator pleading for businesses, governments and consumers to reduce their gas intake. It's asked the biggest firms to submit emergency plans to cut usage further in the winter. That over fears that Russia could cut supplies in response to Western sanctions. This winter, Roders won't be the only European company looking for ways to save gas.